Welcome back to Coffee and Cocktails. My name is Thomas and today we are making the Cape Cotter. So the Cape Cotter is like an elevated version of a vodka cranberry. Everybody's had those. This is just an elevated version of it. So we're gonna do two ounces of FN vodka, four to five ounces of our cranberry juice and a half an ounce of lime juice. Put it into a cocktail shaker over ice, shake it up for about eight to 12 seconds and then strain it into our highball glass and then drop in a lime wedge. Let's make the drink. So like I said, starting off with two ounces of FN vodka. I love the name FN vodka. Great branding. It's real fun. And then we're gonna do four to five ounces of our cranberry juice. And then we're gonna do half an ounce of freshly squeezed lime juice. Squeeze some of this this morning, so just put it into a little bottle. There you go. So we're gonna fill our cocktail shaker up with some ice. shake for about 8 to 12 seconds. Once we have that shaken up, we're just going to pop the seal. We're already seeing that beautiful color of our vodka cranberry. Strain that into a highball glass. Just gorgeous. Then we're going to top it off with a wedge of a lime. I like to line the rim of the glass and then I'm going to do one little squeeze and just drop it right in there. So there you have the Cape Cotter. Cheers everybody. So it's got a beautiful bitterness to it um, that really comes from that cranberry juice um, and pairing it with just a touch, a half an ounce of that lime juice. It's a great balance. With any vodka cocktail, you're really not tasting that vodka so much because it has such a muted tone to it. Um, so it's really playing with those mixes. Um, cranberry juice is kind of very forward. It has a very um, a loud punch to it. Um, so that really sings in this cocktail. So if you're into cranberry juice, if you like your vodka cranberries that you're gonna get at the normal bar, try this at home, add a little bit of lime juice to it, call it a Cape Cotter, put it in a highball glass and enjoy. Cheers guys.